Hey guys, I hope all of you all are doing well today. Today we are doing a quick fragrance review video and I'm sharing with you guys my thoughts on two little fragrances that I received in my last Ipsy bag add-on. So if you guys are ready to see what these smell like, stay tuned. Um, so both of these fragrances were an add-on through Ipsy. I used to get Ipsy. I have since recently canceled Ipsy and I will be getting a new subscription box service. Um, but these were an add-on and I added um, both of these on. Um, this was together for, I think it was a total of $5. So very inexpensive, really good deal. And I got a little body lotion of one of the scents and then I got a eau de parfum of the other scent. Um, both of these are by Nanette Lepore. Um, she is a fashion designer, and this scent right here is Colors of Nanette. Um, so this one is the body lotion, but it is fragranced with the scent. Um, normally, I don't like to use the uh, fragrance scents, I guess you would call the fragrance body lotions that come in like the set with the fragrance, um, because I personally don't like overly um, scented body lotions, but I really thought this one might be nice um, just to kind of wear like maybe just on the neck and have some scent, a little bit of moisturization. I don't need to apply it to my whole body. So the Colors of Nanette is actually one of the older scents and um, this is a perfume um, that I saw. You could get on Fragrance X for between like 20 and 30 dollars i believe 20 to 35 dollars for the full size bottle which i think is 3.4 fluid ounces so a really good price so let's give this one a sniff so i'm just going to apply a little bit to my hand and then i'm just going to kind of put it on and let you guys know what i think it smells like and i did write down the notes so the formula is very moisturizing smells really good. It smells very um, fresh. So with this one here, um, this has notes of melons, jasmine, peaches, rose, and violets. It smells really good. Honestly, to me, it just kind of smells like a regular body lotion. But it does have like a lot of floral notes in it. I can definitely smell the roses, but it has a fresh kind of scent to it as well. And I think that's coming from the melons. So that smells really good, really like that. If you're looking for a good and expensive gift for a female in your life, maybe your mom, maybe a friend, girlfriend, wife, whatever, um, I think this smells really good. It's a nice kind of out of the shower scent, something that you can wear, you know, day or night, smells a little bit fresh, but it has a little hint of floral in there as well. So I really like that one. And then now let's try out this Nanette. Um, this is Beautiful Times. And this is an actual little sprayer bottle. This is 0.34 fluid ounces. So a nice travel size. That's what it looks like. And this one is more of a sweet fragrance. Um, it has the top notes are red fruits, oranges, and the middle notes are rose and violet. Base notes are sponge sugar and vanilla. So let's see how it smells. And I'm just going to give this a little squirt right here. Actually, woo, sprayer is really good. It's a little bit leaky. Um, it's leaking a little bit, but that's just this little sample size. So I'm pretty sure the full size is not going to do that on you. Wow, very sweet. Very, very sweet scent. Can definitely smell the um, spun vanilla right off the bat. Has kind of that like candy note to it. Mm, yeah, very, very sweet. Sponge sugar, and vanilla, definitely first thing I smell. I don't really smell any rose. Don't really smell any orange. Maybe a little bit of like red fruits. Mostly I'm just getting a lot of vanilla, a lot of like candy sugar kind of scent to it. So if you know a um, sweet fragrance lover in your life or someone that likes that sweet candy, um, you know, uh, like Prada candy kind of similar fragrance. They would probably really like this. Very comparable and a lot less than Prada candy. It smells really good. It's not exactly my kind of scent because I don't really like sweet scents, um, but it does smell pretty good. 
and day and night appropriate. Don't really think it any for any certain age either. I feel like any woman could wear this. Um, overall, I think these are both a really nice, um, inexpensive kind of gift you could give for Christmas this year. I know you can get the Beautiful Times by Nanette Lepore, um, a full set at Macy's for I think about $150, um, and that includes other items in there as well. And then this one, very inexpensive on Fragrance X, between $25, I think $20 to $35, I think I saw. So both very inexpensive. This one's better if you like the fresh scent, the um, colors of Nanette, and Beautiful Times, more sweet if you like sweet fragrances or you know someone that does. Um, I hope you guys enjoyed this quick fragrance review. Leave me some comments down below. Have you ever heard of these uh, fragrances or have you ever tried them out? Let me know and I'll see you guys in my next video. Thank you for watching. Bye!